This is our 20 second stream. 20 second video in our YouTube playlist. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. Let's see, what have we done? We have 10 days before before we are in trouble with the Mafia or something like that. Basically, we have 10 days to steal the heart of a Mafia boss. And the reason why we have taken on this target is that we've been blackmailed to do so by one of our teachers. Well, teachers, she's kind of a school a teaching assistant. I don't even remember who she is. But she happens to be a school staff and she also is the sister of a prosecutor in the Tokyo police. So Makoto is the person that asked us, well, blackmailed us into taking on this target. Who is this? Everyone here is definitely on the Akechi Bang Wagon. They even gave him all this nice sparkles. Yeah, Akechi is a young talent in investigation, is a young investigator, detective, and he's onto our case. He's trying to find out who the Phantom Thieves are, but Makoto beat him to it because she has already found out who we are. And she knows that it's us and blackmailed us into taking on this Mafia boss and changing his heart. So let's see how we're gonna do that. I think that we have to move on pretty fast. We have to wait for Hoya to contact us, but I see that Ryuji has got some time free, so perhaps we can talk to him. Yo. Hmm. I can become closer to him. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, what was that? What was that? Oh, come on. Yo. We can become closer to him, but I don't think my bond with Ryuji will deepen just yet, so you know what? Let's not worry about spending time with Ryuji, who also is my least favorite character of all. Let's use the shortcut and see if we can go anywhere else. Let's go to the station. Perhaps it's something we can do in Shibuya or to one of these other destinations. To spend time with Yusuke. Or we could go to Takemi. Oh, let's go to Takemi then. The clinic. Welcome to the stream, everyone. Good to see you. A patron asked me if I had a recommendation for a pair of reading glasses. But I'm not an optometrist. Is it because I have an eye test chart on the wall? At my current level of guts, I should be able to handle that medicine. Yes! Finally, finally, we've done it. Finally, we have enough guts to, to take care of that. Let's suggest another cl clinical trial. We haven't had one in ages. But first, I want to buy something. No, you know what? I don't need anything. Let's go. I developed a new medicine. Could you come to, ba to the back? Yeah, okay. And my bone should grow stronger soon. What are you gonna do? Are you gonna go with Takemi? You bet. Please head to the exam room. Hmm. Here you go. I made various adjustments to the previous drug based on your trial results. Alright, drink it up down in one gulp. Powerful taste, both sour, sour and bitter, overwhelms me. The smell is terrible. <laughs> Your reaction to it is absolutely perfect. What do you mean perfect? It knocked me down. Let's take your temperature and blood pressure. I'm also going to draw some blood. I also want to perform a few motor skill tests, but those might be too much for you right now. Since we're in the final stages, I should first stabilize the fundamental formula. So you are here. What? 
I'm in the middle of an examination. I've told you before, officer, if you want to investigate me, you need to show me a warrant. I'm here because we received a report. I'll need to see a detailed statement of medical expenses and full medical records. I bet you didn't have enough time to hide any incriminating documents, huh? Must be under the orders of the medical chief of staff. Here you go. Hmm? This kid here is my only patient today. If you're asking for his medical expenses, I'm guessing I'm under suspicion of improper billing. But without a receipt, I'll say you've been sent on a wild goose chase. What is going on here? You're being manipulated. That report is fictitious. Nothing about an attempt to harass me. What? Hey you, what are you doing here? You don't seem to be sick. Are you up to something illegal? I have a bad heart. A bad heart? Mm -hmm. He's stressed about taking his entrance exams. Have some drugs that help with relaxation. So, is there anything else? As you can see, I'm pretty busy here. Fine. You're infuriating, you know that? Hmm. But I expect nothing less from the plague. Wow, is that what they call her? <sighs> hey Jay, welcome. Good to see you, man. Good to see you. How you doing, man? I hope you had a good weekend. Thanks for popping in. I'm so over this. The plague? Yeah, let's ask her about the nickname. Why the plague? Oh. Yeah. And could you not say that in front of me? It's a sore subject. It's nothing to worry about. I'm sure it was my former superior who made that false report. You hit drop on our conversation the other day, remember? It's just trying to put pressure on me by having the police investigate me in my practice. By the way. Anyway, I need to draw some blood. There'll be some mild anemia, but only temporary. You'll be fine. It's part of our deal, remember? Let's do it. Unlike kids will listen to their superiors, enjoy your medicine. I feel like my my bond with Takemi is growing even deeper. Yeah. Finally, rank 2. This has been stuck on rank 1 for a long time. All right. No new ability, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm going to draw more blood than usual, since you're healthy and all. Only kidding. Okay, please lie down. You can go home once I'm done. I feel like operating in that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. All right, finally. All right. Take care. It's the first of August in the game. The journalist responded to me. No, sorry, it's not the 1st of August in the game. It's the 18th of June. Well, how did I... What? Well, why did I come up with the 1st of August? I don't know why I said that. Oh, because I mixed up the 18th with the 1 8. Oh my god, I'm so messed up. The Crossroad Bar. This is from that journalist, right? She wants to meet you there now? Are they talking about the journalist who is, um, you know, the one that we have met in front of Kamoshida's place? Looks like this Crossroads place is in Shinjuku. Emitape Shinjuku. <laughs> Will you be my escort? This perhaps is a joke on the fact that there are um, escorts in Shinjuku. In Kabukicho. Um, 
I'm gonna ask very naively, what's Shinjuku like? Mm. Let me see. I guess to put it simply, it's a nightlife district for adults. Well, not all of Shinjuku, but Kabukichu surely is. It's quite unsafe, to be honest. You should send everyone a message and let them know what you're up to. Yeah, that's true. Shinjuku at night, huh? That sounds rather dangerous. Where should we meet up? Stand by and it'll be easy to move around with less of us. My apologies, I don't have the money to take the train there. Then you're on standby too. Me and Andrea will go, okay? Let's do it. If Andrea's going, I guess there's no need to worry. We'll leave it to you then. I guess that's that. Let's meet up in Shibuya. I shall be sure to save money for situations like this from now on. Yeah, you should. Wait. Are you going to school in your unif in your school uniform? It would be bad for you to stand out. You should change before you go. Let's get changed. Thank you very much for leaving a thumbs up. Always appreciated. For real? You're still in your uniform? Huh? I'm sorry, so I didn't have the time to go home. People aren't gonna notice anyways with this t-shirt over it. You actually look quite good in those trousers like that. That's fine. That's not the issue. Are you both idiots? I'm just saying now, I won't be to, bl I won't be to blame when you get caught by the cops. Come on. Don't worry about it. That place isn't so different from Shibuya. Come on, I'll guide you. If we go to Shinjuku, we should probably hop in the JL. Just get out this building and then the, 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 the ticket gate should be on the right. Let's go time! Alright. Kind of a dangerous mission all of a sudden. I don't even remember who called us about it, but let's go. Oh, anything I can buy here? Oh, I can't buy anything. You can find something to drink in Shinjuku. Oh, come on. Okay, fine. Let's go there. This one? This one's for the Ginza line. The ticket gate for the JL is downstairs. Okay. I think one thing that I found extremely confusing in Tokyo was the, was the fact that like Tokyo Line seems to belong to different companies, so it's quite difficult to move around. All right, let's head to Shinjuku. Like it's very confusing. Oh yeah, Shinjuku. How beautiful is this? We have another neighbor to visit. Another heart of Tokyo with an active nightlife and downtown shops. Bars open to minors. Conversation can be enjoyed at any age. All right. Hey. Shinjuku's outside of the area where you commute your pass works. You'll have to pay a fare. Fair enough. Ah, oh, that was lame. Hey Jay, what do you mean you like Yuji? I don't. Anyway, thanks a lot for the thumbs up. Thanks a lot for hanging out as usual. The school commuter train pass allows allows you to travel for free on two railway lines. Yongenjaya to Shibuya and Shibuya to Aoyama Ichome. You will have to pay a fare to travel outside of these areas, so be aware and make travel plans accordingly. That's fine, I'm rich at this point. I should be able to afford a ticket every once in a while. Whoa. Wow, even at night this place is bright as hell. I guess that's Shinjuku for you. Hey. Stop looking around so much, you look like a tourist. Whoa. I was just trying to find that place we're looking for. Crossroad bars right up ahead. I'm sure we'll get there if we keep going straight. I have no idea. Wow, this looks pretty. So I'm trying to understand if this is like an actual spot in Shinjuku. But I don't seem to be any, you know, familiar with any of this. I don't recognize it from 
the Yakuza game, I don't recognize it from the actual Shinjuku, which I visited some time ago. And let me have a look at the plan. Hmm, not particularly distinctive. Oh, you can see that there is Kabukicho sign on in the background. Is it perhaps over here as well? Welcome to our Izakaya. How about some old you can drink booze on the cheap? Wait, you're underage? Is that a problem? <laughs> so you're just a kid. Get out of here, you're in the way. You're not the one who's all wanted to talk to us. Yeah, this is actually quite normal. In Kabukicho, you have all these people that are really trying to force you into their <laughs> business, pretty much. If any of you has ever played the Yakuza games, you'll know what I mean. It's full of traps for tourists and whatnot. Not even for tourists, but traps for people who are quite naive. Hey Luke, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Come on, let's hurry it up and find that place. Okay, okay, let's find that place. Let's avoid the bachelor there. Anything here? Nah. Chinese restaurant. A Chinese restaurant, huh? It's so freaking packed. Is the food here that good? Wait, we can think about that food later. We gotta find that bar now. Okay, okay. Jeez. Where is this place? Adults only store. Let's go. This place in Crossroads. Oh man. Hey man, you wanna come play? That's all you want. No added fees. We have the cutest girls in town. Okay, whatever. Tell me more. Did you really just ask that? Just ignore that guy, you idiot. No matter what way you cut it, it's a shady character. Yeah, so Kabukicho is full of characters like that. People that are really begging you to go into their establishment. You don't need anything from this flower shop. Come on, we gotta find that store sign. But damn, this place is open till 5 in the morning. Who's buying flowers late that late? Yeah, no, that's true. That might be the only legitimate business in the whole of Kabukicho. I've never seen one, by the way. Ramen shop. Is that it? Ramen. Shit. It's a ramen joint. Wanna go eat somewhere when we're done? It's great. It's great. This place is open 24 7, though. I definitely wanna eat here on a late night. Yeah, okay, I'll be for that will be for some other time. So, anything here in this shady place? In this shady back alley? No? Nothing? Do you have a moment? Are you a student? You shouldn't be out this late. I'm a college student. Oh yeah, we're adults, you see. Are you a friend of his? Wait a second, I've seen this pattern on those pants before. Maybe in the news. <laughs> Yeah, it was on that segment about the teacher who was harassing kids. Is that the school uniform? Shit. You kids have got to be high schoolers. Come with me. Hey, wait! Shoot, this is why I said uniforms were a bad idea. Let's run. <laughs> oh my. And... We're literally being chased by the police for being high schoolers out at night. How much longer until we get there? Come on, man. Hi DJ Smith, hi everyone, thanks a lot for coming in. Make sure you leave a thumbs up, a thumbs up that will make me happy. Because, you know, I am happy. I'm very easily content. Um, it ain't our fun we had to deal with that day too. Our school's getting real famous. Yeah, you know what, he has a point. But let's try and find out. What? Hey, who's this character and why does he have a fancy drawing like that? blonde one, I can sense impending woman travels, or perhaps it's something else? In any case, horrible disasters is coming for you. Please let me examine your future further. Huh? Wait, me? Right. Yes, I suggest you get your fortune told, and you change your trousers. Oh, More of this man. shit. Sorry, but we're in a hurry. I don't really believe in that stuff anyways. 
However, if you change your mind, I'll be waiting here in this pot at night. May your fortunes be well. Okay, this is an interesting meeting. <laughs> she likes, yay! <laughs> Big success! Okay, we need to find a way to go up there to the bar and not get caught by the police. Although I don't spot any policemen, I hope they'll just let us be. There it is! New come up. What? Is that it? New come up? Well, whatever. Let's go. Oh man, we ain't old enough to hang out here. You sure this is the place? Beer, whiskey, wine. Looks like night time is bar time. Going in our uniforms is probably a bad idea. We got call this time too. Yeah, you're useless. <laughs> I'm saying nothing back. I feel bad, but I'll leave this to you guys. I'll kill time somewhere nearby. Yeah, you're useless, Yuji, are you? <laughs> I am mistreating Yuji at any given occasion. I'll slap the guy if I could. Welcome, Lala Escargo. Is that actually your name? His name? Her? His? Whatever. Hmm. How old are you, boy? Hey! Hey! He's with me. Oh, you picked up a real young one this time. <laughs> Just don't let the minor drink alcohol, okay? Hope you guys enjoy the voice I'm making for him. Can I talk directly for her? I don't want to talk to her. Yeah, I want to talk to the lady. To the patron. Okay, no, it's not possible. Let's see what Hoya has got for us and let's see if she can investigate on the Mafia people with, together with us. And let's see if we can actually beat this Mafia boss in 10 days. <laughs> Lala-chan, I'm going to borrow the seat in the back. Go on back there, I'll treat you to some water. Ah, oh, she reeks of booze. Ew. <laughs> what a surprise! I thought you were joking, yet here you are! I respect that bravery, so I'll listen to what you have to say. Well, what do you want to know? Yeah, who controls Shibuya? No. Why Shibuya? No, I mean, who controls Shibuya? Let's cut to the chase. I want to know more about our target. Oh. Erika, I'll come and subscribe later. Promise. Anyway, oh. Why that? I need intel on their boss. Hmm. Well, I do happen to know something about that. I could tell you, but... Just tell me. The Phantom Thieves of Hearts? You know, that case the public has been focused on lately. Yeah, DJ. I agree. All, all female in, in Persona 5 games are actually nicely put together, let's say that. You know, that case in the public has been focused on lately. I was pursuing the issue of people randomly entering into a shutdown state, but I'm lacking intel. That's why I'm currently looking for new material to write about. How we don't draw too much attention on us. I mean, I hope Oya doesn't start investigating on us and I hope she doesn't join the dots and, you know, conclude that we are the Phantom Thieves. So, do you have any info on these Phantom Thieves? Erika, claro, claro. Sí, vamos a, uh, vamos a hablar en español. Uh, hola a todos. No, that's it. I can't say much else. I'm really sorry about that. Don't have a very good Spanish. Pero... Niente. <laughs> Nada. So, do you have any info on these Phantom Thieves? Why are you asking me? 
You're a Shujin kid, right? I remember you wearing their uniform the last time we met. I thought maybe you might have some insider knowledge on the Phantom Thieves because of it. Their first incident was that of Kamoshida, you know? Ideally, I'd like to get some exclusive coverage from a student who suffered Kamoshida's abuse. I would love an introduction if you know of someone who fits the bill. Okay, so she wants an interview with somebody who suffered Kamoshida's abuse. So, you know, somebody who was... I, I apologize guys in the chat, I apologize for my terrible attempt at talking in Spanish, I don't even know what I'm saying. Um, I would love an introduction, yeah, okay, we do know somebody, I mean, we do know Mishima. He has been one of those abused by Kamoshida, but I don't want to join those two, because she's a journalist and he's a young student, and he knows way too much about the Phantom Thieves, so if I put her... If I put him in her hands, that would be the end of the Phantom Thieves. She would find out. After all, it seems like handling this matter in the open would be an inconvenience to us both. Hmm. A student who suffered from abuse. Oh, what about that Mishima guy? Yeah. He always seems to be on the side of the Phantom Thieves. Yeah, but you don't want to give Mishima to this girl. She's going to eat him alive. Yeah, how about I say I accept your offer? Because I don't want to have Mishima talking to her. She would be able to get a lot of information out of her, out of him, out of Mishima. So I, I accept your offer myself. It's a deal then. Send me your. No, 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 no. I wanna. I don't wanna. No. Oh damn it! You better be thankful. My quick wit is the only reason we're getting this far. This is a mistake. This is a mistake like getting Ryujo part being part of the Phantom Thieves. Now that I think about it, those mental shutdowns and the Phantom Thieves both seem supernatural. Could they be related? Or am I just hoping for a coincidence? Oh, sorry. I have a tendency to talk to myself on occasion. Well then, you can't exactly consider this an upfront payment, but... Give him alcohol. Junya Kaneshiro. <gasps> we have a name. We have a name. Hey chat, thanks all for stopping by guys, always appreciated. No worries if you have to go, it's cool. I think he's probably the guy you're looking for. Cool, we have a name, that's all we wanted. Muy bien, muy bien. You should check him out further if you're curious. But I'm not responsible for what happens next. Lala Chan, can I get a refill for this kid? We need to make a toast to our new acquaintance. All right. It'll be a problem if you stay too long. You should leave right after you finish your water. Come on, Morgana, the night has only just started. It only just began. Yes! We did it! We finally got in front of the target. Let's meet up with Ryuji. Yeah, but where is it? How'd it go? Yeah. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna say I can't say. Come on, man, don't play hard to get. Anyways, we should meet up as soon as possible. I'll be in front of the movie theater, so head on over. It's that kind of open area you passed on your way to the bar. So we just have to go back all the way, yeah? Yeah, 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 we're gonna just do that. First, let me have a look at Kabukicho a bit more. Shall we go in here? And, and then there is kanji that I can't quite read. You know that little kanji up there? It seems like a kanji with a sonic head. Anyway. 
No, I wanna go in there. Goodness, they sell so many different things here. Do pawn shops make a lot of money? That's just taking the scenery. Macron. Okay, whatever. Hey, perhaps I can interact with this lady before. If you would like your fortune read, I'll be waiting here in this night. To okay, blah blah blah. Let's go. Hey! I'm tired of waiting. You got any dirt on our next target? For real? Junior Kaneshiro. Dude, don't shout. Damn it, Yuji. Always putting us in trouble. And enter. All right. Here we go. What happened? Okay, now we just gotta get some info on the distortion. Once we know that, it's Palestine. Wait, Let's try more. It'll be better when we have the whole team together. Yep. Dude! Oh, a real huge catch, you say? I'm getting pumped too. What a cutie and so muscular, so muscular too. I give you an 85 of the 100. <laughs> uh, who are you? I'm the naughty troll of Shinjuku. I'm gonna eat you up. Whoa! Well, <laughs> do you help? You can't hear me? Can't you? <laughs> so, this is Shinjuku. So popular. I'm just gonna go with you're so popular. You show them you're in a man. <laughs> yeah, show them. You no, you're so popular. What? Yeah, you want a taste of all that feels? Hey, you can take my place. Get over here. What an energetic stud muffin. I'll give you all the freebies you could ever desire. The night is young, and so are you. Let's party it up. <laughs> You um, come back alive. Want to head back? Hey, uh, Gyuji disappeared. Perhaps he didn't manage to shake those two guys off his tail. We'll talk to him tomorrow and see what happens. Did you find any clues? I'll tell you tomorrow. Considering how you're trying to keep us in suspense, I expect it will be good news. Well then, let's meet up at the hideout tomorrow. Yuji seems to be absent from this conversation. Should we contact him separately? I'm sure he'll figure it out when he checks his phone later. Yuji is probably having some affairs with the two guys. See, Erika. Dos Maricons. We're pretty much already in Kaneshiro's palace. That was surprisingly easy. Yuji's gone. <sighs> Goodbye, Yuji. He's gone to the other side. Good for him. Shinjuku show was crazy, huh? Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, hey, some girls just messaged, <laughs> sorry, messaged me saying you told her about me. She said she's interested in me. What's this about? And what kind of girl is Oya's son? Is she cute? Is she hot? She's totally cute. Oh, she's definitely out. Oh man, I don't know. I don't want to commit to something. I'm just gonna get, go with you, see. So I won't be disappointed. Don't tease me. I'm gonna lose sleep over this. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, son. She 
says you wanted to talk. How much forward can a girl can a can a girl I get? Is this really what I think it is? Could it be? You'll find out. Man, I'm so looking forward to this now. Yeah, this is all thanks to you. I feel like starting the fun side has really changed me. Anyway, I can handle this. You introduce me, so I'll make sure I don't embarrass you. And I'll totally let you know if we end up hooking it up. Okay, okay. Too much, too much enthusiasm there. Mm. Shinjuku, the city that never sleeps. It's a fascinating place, don't you think? You should go back sometime. Yeah, whatever. We have an update on the arson case at the factory for restaurant Jaya Hanehuya. The arrested employee continues to state that he cannot recall ever committing the crime. With no testi testimonies or link to a motivation, the cause remains unclear. Crimes with suspects unable to explain their motives continue to occur in the restaurant industry. There's all sorts of incidents going on. Arson is pretty scary. Well then. Let's try going to Shinjuku again. It seems like there were a lot of places worth checking out. Yeah, that's true. But I guess it's late to watch some DVDs, right? Yeah, let's go to sleep. Okay. As long as we know what we're aiming for, we'll figure the rest out somehow. Tomorrow's gonna be a busy day, so let's get to bed. Vale. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not going to show my face in the streams. I prefer not to. I can't believe you guys ditched me yesterday. I almost entered a world I want nothing to do with. <laughs> oh my God, Yuji. AJ, yeah, I should go to the velvet room. I'll make sure to do that soon. Come on, Yuji. I'm sure you enjoyed. What are you talking about? Nothing! Just start it up, Yusuke. Okay, I entered Kaneshiro's name into the nav. And just as expected, it's a hit. All we need now are the two other key words. What he thinks of as his palace, and where it is. But we don't have any clues other than people falling victim around here. Hmm. Eh, we'll just have to try whatever key words we can come up with. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be impossible. How many buildings do you think there are in Shibuya? No complaining. If we can figure out what the palace is, we may be able to guess where it is by association. Hmm. It's probably somewhere he's got complete control over. Maybe a garden? Hmm. No candidates found. He likes money, so what about a money bath? I've seen people online with things like that. No candidates found. No, not even close. Hmm. How about it? Can you think of anything? A bank? I see. Candidates found. Okay, that's a hit. Right, okay. So, he thinks of somewhere in this city as his own bank. Somewhere in the city as his own bank. I thought it would be something less realistic. That's all it is, huh? Now then, what location would Kaneshiro think of as his bank? The actual bank. If we're talking about a place where he keeps his cash, maybe his own hideout? Perhaps. How about a real bank? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. His cognition wouldn't be distorted in that case. Oh. Damn it, we ain't getting anywhere. This may be difficult to explain, but doesn't it seem we're thinking a little too inside the box? Hmm. Palaces emanate a passionate madness. It feels as though we're missing that aspect. What the hell are you talking about? This palace is a bank for someone who extorts money with criminal acts. It's something more... Hmm. But what other ways can we think about it? 
Oh, could it mean a place you withdraw money? Huh. Hold on. Do you think it might have something to do with the victims? Hmm. He's taking money from his victims' wallets, right? That means his bank is wherever they are. Hmm. That's terrible. But you may just be right. Oh, come on! How many people do you think Kaneshiro's taken advantage of in all of Shibuya? Wait a second. I have a hit. Huh? Oh, wait, what? D did I say something right? The place that Kaneshiro thinks of as a bank is... all of Shibuya. Oh... So that's what we needed to say to unlock the location. What? Like, the entire city? I see. That's certainly where his victims are. It turns out he really is a terrible criminal. But wait, is it okay for us to go into the palace right out of a crowd like this? Yeah, we can't really just teleport from the middle of the square. Eh, nobody notices if a piece of trash disappears from a trash can. This ain't any different. In that case, let's go. No, careful. We're gonna we're gonna drag people with us. And here we go, guys. We have a new palace. This is gonna keep us very busy for the coming day, days in the game. What are those? Uh oh. Walking ATMs. That must be his cognition of people. Wow. So this is what Kaneshiro considers a bank. I never thought it would be the entire district. Look around us. The distortion is affecting the whole of Shibuya. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, that's right. Even when we were in the castle and the museum, the city outside looked normal. He sees everyone in Shibuya as his patron. No surprise for a mafia boss. It's best we focus on finding Kaneshiro's location and stealing his treasure as soon as possible. Hmm. Yeah, his hideout's gotta be somewhere around here. Let's go look for it. In any case, let's look for a bank. There should be a huge one around here somewhere. Can I interact with these ATMs? They are not worth my time, are they? Okay. ATM human. This is terrible, just what happened to him. This poor guy didn't make it. Can I go in there? No. Can I go in there? No. Hey! Look at that person trampling over there. Do you think he's a victim? We should talk to him. Uh... Do these guys even have mouths? Excuse me, can we? Please forgive me. What happened? I don't have any more, please. I'm telling you, not even one yen. Come on, man. Oh. Cool, we're not trying to mug you or anything. Please, I don't want to end up like the others. Were you assaulted? <sighs> There's no doubt there's a victim, but he can't even hold a goddamn conversation. Let's try someone else. AJ, yes. Doesn't matter how many people are watching, as long as who is watching is really enjoying. Going there? No, nothing. Something? No. Hey, what's all these things? No, is that money? Is that money? Yeah, that looks like notes. Okay. 
Perhaps. Are those? No. It's terrible. Wolf, these are real people, right? What the hell? I don't think we can talk to any of the ones here. There's more over there. Damn it! All these guys kind of show us victims. That would appear to be the case, but there is nobody we can speak to, let alone a bank anywhere. Joker! Let us try checking around the station once more. We may have overlooked something important. Let's go back to the station. Oh, someone is here. Wait! Look, do you think that person's a victim too? He wasn't there earlier. Hey! Excuse me, can we have a word? We are... It's no use, it's all over. I will end up just like them. Where's kind of sure? Where else? A place where he leaves no tracks. Not that knowing where it is will help you. What could that mean? You gotta tell us a little more than... I'm too tired, please let me rest. Bang. I don't think he can speak anymore. <laughs> well, you don't say. Kanashio leaves no tracks. Does it mean that literally? Does he mean that literally or could it be figurative? Hey. Why don't we go over all the intel we have now? Hmm. They have apparently fallen quite far. Wait a second, they have fallen from a place that Kanashio doesn't leave any tracks? Could that mean they were actually thrown down from somewhere high up? Uh, what, you mean like a skyscraper? There ain't any of them around here, I don't think. Wait, what's that? What's going on? What? Is that it? Oh my god, Independence Day. Up in the air. No wonder we couldn't find it. Kind of sheer doesn't leave any tracks, huh? Figures it'd be floating. Oh, wow. Really Independence Day, but that, you know, cool. How do we get there? So, uh, how do we get up there? <laughs> right. Can you turn into a helicopter, Morgana? No, just a car. You're useless! Come on! Don't you have some kind of secret gadget or something? Shut up, Gucci. Shut it! I'm not some robot cat! I mean, I'm not a cat at all! This may be the limit of what we can do today. Hmm. We gotta find a way to get up there. There's gotta be a way. I mean, if he gets up there, surely there is a way for us to get up there too. Let's think about it some more tomorrow, okay? No, no, I wanna go fight. Alright, we should get out of here for now. Run for it! Cool. Hola, Ega. ¿Qué tal? I have a new message from Hoya. Evening. Reeks of alcohol. You free? Slow day, eh? Huh? Yeah, let me let me show her some attitude. Let me give her a little attitude. I'm texting you amid my busy work schedule. It's about that kind of shoe guy. He's more dangerous than I thought. The police haven't tracked him down, so I dug a little deeper. Turns out he has some real shady connections. I won't say any more than that. It's not someone it's not someone a teenager like you should mess with. You should really back off, okay? Well, that's what I wanted to say. See ya. Batman. Proving our justice isn't going to be easy. We better discuss this with everyone tomorrow. Yeah. You know. Nothing's gonna stop us at this point. I bet, I bet, I don't know. 
just when we find the palace, it's all the way up in the sky. What a pain. I'm sure the police are tired of this guy too. Well then. That reminds me, the Om Shopping program is airing today. Okay guys, let's check out the program. It's time to do some shopping. 20 boxes, boxes of mental floss. Floss with these and you magically remember things you never knew. I... what? What kind of item is this? It's true, I always think about all sorts of random things while I'm just flossing my feet. This is a limited item. It can be yours for the incredibly price of... okay, well... 2000 yen because it's on sale. Shall we get it? 2000 yen? Yeah! Yeah, shall we get it? Almost. Okay, it's done. We'll try to get your order to you as soon as possible. Goodbye for now. Okay. Can I watch the video or something? No? Hmm. I didn't expect the palace to be floating in the sky. Can we do anything? Oh, okay, no, I can only go to sleep. Let me check out the plant. Nice. Looking pretty healthy for now, okay. Oh, you know what I can do? Let's do it. It may be a wise thing to actually just save. Great music. This game has got some really nice chill music. Well, we can't do anything if we can't infiltrate the palace. We'll have to think of something. Let's sleep. I've been thinking lately. Hmm. <laughs> what has you been thinking? About those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive. Ooh, wait, wait. This is this is a piece of info that we didn't add earlier. The phantom thieves and no way. I'm talking about the Makoto and Sai, her sister Sai. Apparently, they had a dad and it's gone. Sorry, I, I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. And it's a sore point that they don't bring up very often. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if he would have been on their side. That's all. Hmm. Wonder why they're asking yourselves that. The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. That's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home... Okay, Sai is now bitching <laughs> to her, pretty much. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. I've no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts, yeah. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care. Hey, cut it short, girl. He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. Whoa. Whoa, she's bitter. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? Right now, you're useless to me. Ouch. All you do is eat away at my life. Ouch. <sighs> Sorry, that was uncalled for. I'm just really tired. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. Wow. <sighs> Damn, what a nice relationship these two have. Hey Styles, welcome to the stream.
We ain't got nothing. Yeah, he was in beast mode indeed. We ain't got nothing. Are we out of luck? It's no fair his palace is up in the sky. If only we could contact the real Kanashiro. Hmm? What do you want? Nothing in particular. I just saw you all together here. Huh, that's so. Hmm. You seem to be having quite a bit of trouble. So you're here to check up on us? Right, if you guys missed the previous episodes, she is the girl that is now blackmailing us into finding out who this mafia boss is and changing his heart. We're doing a commission job for her. You may be the student council president, but when it comes to what we do, you're useless. Useless? Yep. Right now, you're useless to me. It hurts, doesn't it? Eat away at my life. Ooh, that hurts. To be frank, yes. Ouch. Just stay on your high horse and watch. Or do you want to eavesdrop since you're so good at it? Ooh. <laughs> my god, they're really bashing on her head. Life is slapping her. So you wish to get in contact with Kanashiro? That is what you were just discussing, weren't you? My god, she's a professional eavesdropper. It seemed you just needed to find out where he is. Not from you. Like I said, stay out of this. So you're just the good girl type to push over. Right now, you're useless to me. I'm not. What was that? Fine. I'll help you meet Kanashiro. Whoa, that went... Exactly, is she planning on doing? That went completely over her head. She had a dead serious look in her eyes. Yeah, trouble for everyone. Does this mean she has an idea as to where Kanashiro may be? I highly doubt that. I didn't like her stern face. Ugh, what is up with her? Yeah, I'm afraid she might be doing something stupid and get us into further troubles revealing well, our identities. Here? We're never going to find her. Hello, it's me, Makoto Nijima. Just stay on the phone and listen. Make sure you record the call as well. Huh? Who is it? Do you guys know Kanashiro? What? That idiot! What's she doing? I heard I could find someone named Kanashiro if I came to Central Street. She's in the middle of Central Street and she's literally talking to people, poking them and querying and asking for Kanashiro in the middle of Central Street. She's gonna get a lot of attention from the Mafia guys now. Central Street! She's being too rash. Yeah, she's crazy. This is a suicide. What are you getting at? Hey guys in the chat and in the comments there. Um, I usually stream, not every day, but almost every day I try. Let's say, well, let's say any other day. I stream in the evening at European time, which is usually afternoon in the US and Canada etc so it's usually in dinner time the evening that's when I that's when I stream and I stream for about an hour an hour and a half each evening he's blackmailing the students of Shujin Academy is he not tell him if he doesn't want me talking to the police about it 
He better agree to meet with me. You got a death wish or something? He says he'll meet you. Get in. You better be taking me to Kanashiro. He said get the fuck in! Hey, wasn't that... Uh-oh, she got in the car. It's the guys that messed with us the other... You never should get in the car. So they were connected to Kanashiro. Is she still on? Contact Kanashiro, son. Tell him we got a good one. Ooh. Where are we going? Yeah, I guess we can't do anything to her if she's Kanashiro san's customer. Kanashiro san's customer? Hey, I asked a question here. Where are we going? We gotta go after them. Ryuji, get a taxi. I'll. Okay, I've got their license plate. My sketching skills have come in handy. Oh wow, your heroical sketching skills have saved the day. Ah, shit, he ignored me! Oh my god, Antamakama came now. And Takamaki came in the chat room. This is weird. I said stop! Stop the cab. Ryuji! Hurry up and get in! You're from Panama? Wow. So, you're seriously the student council president of Shujin. Wow, look at him. Yeah, he's a proper mafia. You know what happens to anyone who snaps at me, don't you? So, whose number is this? Your boyfriend? What in the world? Who the fuck are you? Need your masson. What the hell did you do to her? Oh, I get it. You got followed, you dumb shits. Wow, the situation's got really dark now. Holy moly! Uh-oh. That bag you saw the other day, the crocodile one, how much was it? Mm, about three million. Thank those guys. What? I'm royally pissed right now. Can you tell? You know how spending money relieves stress? It's you goddamn brats sniffing around like dogs and barging in here like you own the joint. Ooh. See this empty space? I'm so pissed that now there's a three million yen gap here. Uh oh. It pisses me off even more if I don't fill it up. I'm a perfectionist. So, good luck. What is that supposed to mean? Come on, you all look so tense. I think I'll call it debauchery of minors at a club. So, can I send this to your school? Well, is it like mating us? Uh, that's... Oh damn, I got booze and six in the shot. Maybe some drugs too. Ah, oh, this is so hilarious. I feed on dumb shits like you. Understand, pretty little student council president. Now listen up. Run your mouth to the police. And I'll break all of you, starting with your families. I want to give you the usual money, but well, you have such a large group here. 
three weeks. Bring three million yen by then, no less. What? Summer bonuses are around the corner, you know. It'll be easy if you beg your mommies and daddies. <laughs> now get out of my sight. I'm about to have some fun. What? To hell with that! Don't bother with him. Makoto's safety is more important right now. We need to get to him to the palace, yeah. Three weeks for things have taken a serious turn for the worse. Yeah, well done guys, you were trying to save her and now we are being <laughs> blackmailed by Mafia. So you silly, you silly girl, you ruined it for everybody. I didn't mean to drag you in like this. But you did. <laughs> for real. Shut up you. I was stupid. I must agree, you should have easily imagined this happening. Hey, Yusuke! No, he's right. He's right. I was so caught up in trying to be useful. All right, enough of the blame game. What's done is done. I'm gonna cause trouble for Sis, too. Sis? My older sister has a commendable job, and she's a much more remarkable person than me. A lot happened after we lost our father three years ago. So it's just us living together. But I'm still a child. So all I am is a burden to her. Hmm. And that's why you were so reckless? I just wanted to be useful in some way to someone. You know, I might not get your whole situation, but ain't it a bit off saying that you're useless to her? It's the truth, though. Hmm. In particular, I have to apologize for what happened to you. Huh? Now that I think on it, the truth about Kamashita must have been covered up by the whole school. Yeah, finally you admit to that. Finally you admit to that. I had my suspicions, but I couldn't do anything about it. No, I didn't do anything. Had I cared enough, I could have done something. <sighs> People like me must really be what others call scum of the earth. Real scum wouldn't call themselves that. Huh? That's a good line. Real scum would never admit to being scum because they're scum. Right? I'm the same. It's just like you said before. I was closest to Shiho, but I didn't do anything. Besides, Kamoshida's the one to blame. Shiho understands that, and I do too. Takamaki san. You didn't have a place to belong either. Isn't that right? Me either? We won't let anyone fall victim again. Now, what should we do from here? I'll do something about the money. What can you do about the money? So can we please just drop the case with Kanashiro? No. No can do. We're all caught up in this. We can't have you rushing things on your own anymore and making the situation worse. Yep. If only we could do something about that bank. Ryuji. Bank? Oh, right. The bank. Okay, Morgana, we're trying to keep it under wraps. If you guys keep talking in front of her, you know that you're not helping. She isn't useless at all. She may be our key in. What? Hear me out, you guys. Our key in? What do you mean? A cat? Um, 
Are you all okay? Silence, Makoto. We're trying to talk to the cat here. We've become Kaneshiro's targets. That means we've become customers of Kaneshiro's bank. I see. The reason why we couldn't enter before was because we weren't considered his customers. Oh, that's why the person in the car was saying that she was one of his customer. Oh, I get it. And wouldn't you say that she in particular is a special customer? Let's take her with us. She is responsible for our current situation. Wow, so Morgana is now proposing that we take her on board and we take her to the palace with us and doing so would allow us to, you know, infiltrate the palace which would otherwise be impossible without her Whoa, I don't follow this at all Of course you don't She risked her life doing something so reckless At the very least, she has the right to know Won't you come with us? What? Wait, to where? Yeah, where are we going? Beats me. Boom. And it's magic, and we teleport to the palace. It's not actual magic, though. Sorry. A canine? It's Fox. Be quiet! The shadows are going to notice us! A monster cat? A <laughs> monster cat. I'm not! That's Morgana, the cat that was in his bag. This is what happens when we come here. That voice... Takamaki-san? Where are we? We're inside Kaneshiro's... Uh, well... The world inside his heart. Well explained. What? Yeah. It's another reality in which Kaneshiro's distorted desires have materialized. Yep, in a nutshell. Another reality? It's floating in the air. Th this is reality? <sighs> I'm sorry, it's just... But since this really exists, I can't doubt it. Nope. A reality that one's heart shows. Is it like the application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology? The application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology. Hmm. For the sake of those in need, huh? Mm-hmm. That's the old motif of the Phantom Thieves. You sound like my father. Oh. Your father? No, that don't mind me. You want to go to that bank, right? Let's go then. If I've become a customer of that bank, then they'll have to let me in. For real? It came to us! Wow. Worked. It's just as I calculated. Harry guy in the chat. We got it. Enough for now. You know how you can use your card to get into banks during after hours? can use your car to get into banks during after hours. Oh yeah, okay, I know what you mean. Like you slide your bank card at the front door and you get into that little reception with the ATM. I thought that I'd be able to get in, since I have the same identity as such customers. I'm kind of Shiro's source of revenue after all. Oh, that makes sense. But wow. This place is huge. I rarely gotta go to the bank, so this is making me kind of nervous. Being in a bank with costumes like these is so obvious. We are totally robbers. Yeah. You got that right. 
It seems there will be a lot of shadows from here on. Huh? What's that about? Enemies attack us here. I see. I've trained in Aikido. Don't worry. I can defend myself. Yeah, I don't know about that. Self-defense won't do much good against shadows. But then again, it's better than nothing. We have to go in from the front, don't we? I'm an honorary customer, so I better act like one. I will be useful for you guys. Fair enough. She just wants to be useful. Get inside the bank. This is the third eye vision. Let's see if it's any use. My mind is made up. Let's go inside. Joker. I'm ready whenever you need me. Put me in coach. Stay here. Yeah. Nobody likes you. I can feel it. Shall we stay here? What's there? There's a pig statue. Damn, that's one hell of a pig. Adopt is for collecting money. So why is a pig decorating the entrance? Because it's a guinea pig, that's where you keep coins. Yeah. See it. Anything else we'll need to examine at the entrance? This guinea pig fell off. Let's get in. Oh, let's try. All right, we're going in. What business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. Oh, wow, Makoto's actually going for a fight. No, no, wait. She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Let him pass. Wow, that was Kaneshiro's voice. That voice. It's Kaneshiro. You mean a bank has a president? They make good money. Perception is further into the right. I strongly advise that you do not attempt to go elsewhere. talk to these people oh look at them what are they doing what's he doing like that it's a very strange pose isn't it anyway it's somewhere where do I go find a reception room through here Just past this door. No, not that way. Fine, let's go this way. This option is just to the right. Don't go anywhere else. It's somewhere. Sure. How about I walk here? No, okay. <sighs> Fine. Incredible. This place is gigantic. To think such a large bank exists in the sky. I can feel it. Oh, look at this nice little plants in a bank. That's weird. Reception office here. Okay, guys, let's go. I can see it. 
see it. Mountain of cash? Is that actual money? Good night, everyone in the chat room. Thanks a lot for hanging out. How many beef balls could I eat with this? Buenas noches. How many beef balls could you could I eat with this? Unauthorized entry, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to three million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? <laughs> Miss Beautiful President. It must be quite tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. Wow, this is kind of Shigo shadow version. He has a very funny looking moustache. That's all I'm gonna say. You gonna call it off then? Good, good. And don't have a leave us. No, alone. The interest rate is ten percent a day. Ten percent interest a day. Um, uh, that means uh, one day is thirty thousand yen. It's three hundred thousand yen. Right, three hundred. Oops. There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. People like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Ujima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Ujima. Yep. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are so useful. They lack physical strength and are dumb. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. Wow. It's truly sexist. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kanashiro. We're gonna snatch your treasure from you. Kyuji, don't tell him. Don't tell him or we'll just make it difficult. Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> oh, wow. Get them. Here we go, here we go. First fight in the new palace, guys. And it's looking tough. Look at these guys, they look quite scary. It's Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. Ooh, okay. Okay. Persona. Let me see if I can change persona. Don't I have that persona that does all possible attacks? No, I don't have that. So I'll keep this one. Let's try to go with magical attacks first. But first of all, you know what? I'm gonna decrease the attack for three turns. There. That's a good one to do. And then I'm gonna try with wind. Hmm, that kinda worked. I'm gonna try with fire. I'm gonna decrease his attack as well. By decreasing their attack, I will have more time to, you know, figure out a way to get to the weakness. Let's try with ice. Prepare yourself. Ooh. Okay. Good thing we had decreased their attack rate. Persona. Let's try with zeal. There. Okay. They don't seem to be particularly weak to anything. But we've almost killed one of them, so... Let's try with fire. Let's try that. Ooh, fire quite worked. This is my other self. 
Let's go with physical attack now. He's resisted that. Damn. And got really damaged. No, not again. Ooh. Careful. Should I attack him or heal? What do I do? Let's recover a bit for everybody. Much thanks. Ooh, that's a big help. Get back. With style and great. Let's try with with a gun. No, forget it. I'm not gonna go with a gun. I'm gonna try and do media and heal for everybody. Ha! I appreciate it. Thank you. Let's go with fire. Go! Yeah. Damn! More of them? I don't it's a good thing I healed. Tell you what, I'm gonna go with... Let's see. Mm. Physical attack is not exactly what hurt them the most. I can try and go with... Mm, I don't know. I'm gonna keep with this guy because I'm resistive to physical attack. Let me try Zero again. Go down. I need to do Tagunda, decrease attack for one. Persona. Better if I do media. Yeah, I better heal before I attack again. Thank you. Oh, that's a big help. Let's go. Ha! I am thou. Come on, come on. Tell you what, let's use the this attack. That wasn't very good. Right. Good, good, good. Oh man! Once more? Ouch. What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. No, 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 I want the experience points. Don't run. I decided to just make a run for it and leave. It can't be. Why did the security guards turn into monsters? And what were their supernatural powers? Could those have been the personas you mentioned? Does not really look like the time to be asking that. We need to retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't get separated from us. Joker! Joker, the exit is just over there. Careful. I'll be the judge of where we'll be going. I want to go back. Come on. Hey, don't got time to be heading back right now. Okay. It's somewhere. Focus. Where do we go? Shall we go this way? Enemy. This way! Let's go for the exit, hurry! Okay, we cannot go that way. Fine. For today, we cannot really engage in battle any further. We just need to make a run for the exit, and that's what we'll do. Uh oh. There's no end to them! Guys! You seem to be in quite a pickle. This character 
reminds me of the slime in Dragon Quest. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro? Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough. That's why I make it a case to kill troublesome customers. Uh -oh. Having one impertinent brat disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Oh, so that's what you do. You punish people here to scare people in the other in the other world and rule by fear. Please stop. I'll eliminate others besides my goods. You don't need to worry. Your sister is quite a beauty though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Wow. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful. If only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. Oh. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Oh, I think that I think that Makoto is about to snap. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then. <laughs> uh oh, little camera movement. The camera is moving up towards to behind her shoulder. That's the camera angle of attack. I've been listening to you go on and on. There you go, guys. He's coming. We have a new Persona user to to play with. Shut your damn mouth, you money grubbing asshole! Yeah. Huh? Have you decided to tread the path of strife? Yes. Come to me. Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. What the hell?! Wow. A persona? No, dude. That's a bike. That's badass. I can feel it. Myself. Me. Got it! <laughs> wow. Nice. What is that? I've never seen anything like it! You better earn your keep, or else I'll kill you! I will not lose heart again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non-stop! Right, Johanna? <laughs> Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice! Let's go, Johanna! Full throttle! Alright, guys. The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening. Right. Hmm. I don't know this enemy. Uh, but I don't know her. What can she do? She does fray and my fray. 
Let's try nuclear on one of them. Fuck it, let's try nuclear on all of them. Ooh, one of them was weak to it. That's good. We learned something new. Nuclear is that, at you see that one? The light blue element. And usually, you know, you don't get a lot of characters that are capable of doing attacks or, you know, magic of that element. I can increase defense for one life or three turn. I can do diorama. And medio physical to damage to all foes. I don't really think I need to do that. Uh, what I'm going to do instead is to... Let's have a look at guns. I'll tell you what, let's do a physical attack. Mm, wow, she seems to be pretty tough. Oh no. Damn, these guys are strong. Let me decrease attack. Hmm, I don't have Morgana anymore, so what I need to do is to use media myself. Because I cannot rely on Morgana doing the healing magic for us. I appreciate it. Persona! The opponent is strong and tough, but weak to nuclear. You know what to do, right? He did ice attacks, right? Let's try this. There you go, I knew that that was a bad idea. I just healed him 93, 93 points. It was terrible, but you know. Let me decrease attack with this guy. All right. Let me go with nuclear attacks again. I'm gonna guard. It's a good thing I was guarding with her. Alright. This is my other self. Hmm. Tell you what, I need to heal. Can I have anything that heals everybody? Like this one? Yeah, I think this will do. Better than nothing. Time for this. Better than nothing, yeah. Let's try with fire now. Come on, come on. Okay. Shall we talk to him? I don't want to talk to you. That won't work right now. Fine, there's only one thing left to do then. No. Watch your health. Breathing room. Heal. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I need to heal her. It's time. Don't rush it. Calm down. How do I heal her? Come on, there's gotta be a way. Wow. 
Let's do some damage. Come on. I landed. Yeah. Now, let's get out of here. Good, good, good. Some good experience there. Level twenty-one. Power courses through me. I can now create personas up to level twenty-one. That's always good news. We know how to get in now. Our objective's been accomplished. That's true. We found our way in for new um, infiltrations in the future. But how are we getting out? Yeah, that's true. There's only one exit, right? What's up, Miss Post Apocalyptic Raider? <laughs> Do you want to get smacked? Uh oh, she's a tough cookie now. I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. There's no escape in reality. Nor will you break through the security system here. There's not a snowball's chance in hell that a bright future lies ahead for you. Not a snowball's chance. A snowball's chance in hell. <laughs> Okay guys, we found our match. This seems to be a very tough enemy to deal with. Man, talk about wild. Yeah. That was no Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. I am so not pissing her off. I feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. <laughs> she exudes that aura. Oh, stop it. This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years, but it felt pretty great. I never thought I'd become part of the Phantom Thieves I was after. You see? Sis might faint if she found out. Yeah, let's hope she never finds out. Although we already know that she will. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the Phantom Thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, it must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but there are times I feel sorry for her too. Oh. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. Hey, I was trying to be the advisor here. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. Okay, and that was sexist. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's correct. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. That's right. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system too. But 
if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great. We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. And there we are. And there we go, we have a new... A new party member. More messages for us to read. Damn, motorcycles are cool. I wish my persona was like that. Yours is on the ship, though. Dude, you kidding? Motorcycles are way cooler than dump boats. I'll be just like this song. I'm a phantom on a still horse I ride. Don't say such things. And for the record, I'm most certainly not wanted. Honestly, I'm mostly just surprised you know how to ride a motorcycle at all, Nijima Senpai. Do you got a license? A regular one, yes. Nice, I can't wait to get my hands on one too. That aside, mind if I change the topic for a moment? What is the matter? I'm sorry, I know I'm not in any position to be sane, but I truly do. I must apologize. It was my actions that dragged all of you into this mess. On top of that, I misunderstood your true intentions in this. If only I could have realized what was happening to Suzui-san. Come on, we don't need to talk about that now. It seems there are still lingering issues on everyone's minds. Now's not the time to be talking about that shit, though. Don't we gotta be doing something about Kaneshiro? He's right. Very well, I understand. I will do my best to make sure I don't slow you all down. Well, we were at odds with each other until just a moment ago. But Ryuji's totally right. We need to work together to overcome this. Makoto seems like she'd make a reliable advisor. But now we're going up against the real criminal. Stay on your toes, okay? That's right. Crimes don't happen inside a conference room. They're happening out there in the real world. Why are you telling me this? This detective knows what's going on. Drawing on your important first-hand experience is important. Yeah, whatever. Let's not do that today. Nice. Everything looks normal. Hey. And we're all too tired. Okay, guys, I'm gonna save now and stop this stream for now. And we're gonna see you at the next video and the next stream. This video will be part of my playlist on YouTube. And as always, I thank you all for watching and I hope you're having fun. Thank you very much for hanging out, guys, and good night. Thank you all for leaving a thumbs up on the video and for subscribing to the channel and for following the channel. It's very much appreciated. Have a good night. I'll see you guys tomorrow.